Well, moving on to our other big story of the night. On 2 News at 4 o'clock, we've showed you how Endow is making sure bears stay out of our neighborhoods in, in our area. They say by catching and releasing them, they give the bear a negative experience. Valentina Bonaparte joins us now live from Mount Rose. Now, Valentina, not everyone likes this idea of bear traps. Not everyone likes the idea. They say bears are not the problem. The problem and the problem is that people are leaving some trash out of the house and that is not right. And here's some recent file video showing bears breaking into Tahoe homes, getting too close to comfort for humans. To avoid those type of situations, Endow sets up traps every year. They say the goal is to give the bear a negative experience so they never come back. But those against that say bears can come back and trapping is not the way to keep them out of the neighborhood. It should fall upon the homeowner, not the hapless bear that is just being a bear and trying to find food sources. What are you doing, buddy? They say there are other ways to keep the bears away and the methods being used should be changed. Some of the ways they say as simple as keeping the trash secured or buying a bear proof container since a lot of people in Tahoe still don't have some of those. Because we coexist and for the people, the visitors or for people that are moving up here that don't know, perhaps they could be educated how to be bear aware in bear country and on that statement Endow and I are on the same page. And again, it's good to remind people, if you see a bear, try not to get close to it, try not to feed it or take pictures of the bear. Try to keep a safe dis distance and that's, that's, a good, that's a better idea than getting close. For now, covering the story, Valentina Bonaparte, 2 News.